to eat the fruits um, for two reasons. Uh, reason number one is that fruits in general are sometimes sweet. And if you juice the fruit and drink it, of course, that sugar gets to your blood cells much faster. And so because it gets there faster, it triggers, um, you know, it triggers what is called um, that type 2 diabetes in the long run if you're, con if you're constantly doing it, do it. Because, of course, with it getting to your cells very quickly, what will happen is that it will convert into to glucose. And once it is converted to glucose, then the body now has to produce insulin in order to flush that out. However, if you consume your fruits and your vegetables, it takes a little time longer for your body to digest, yes, to digest um, your, these fruits and vegetables. And so it's just a small portion that gets into your bloodstream at a time. And so with that in mind, um, it, 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 the Product, the overproduction of insulin does not occur. But if you are juicing and drinking the juice, and especially if you are that guy or girl that is always adding more sugar, yes, I did say that, more sugar, because this, the fruit already is sweet. Yes, it has that nice, important sugar known as you know fructose, right? And so you're consuming that on a daily basis, right? But of course, uh, you know, once you're having the actual fruit, it's a lot safer than the juice of the fruit, right? Um, so that's a learning, that's a lesson there for you. But also, your roughages are important um, to eliminate constipation. But if you see that you're having your roughage, your roughage is in your diet. If you see that you're consuming your fruits and vegetables, which of course has those roughages. If you see, for example, that you are consuming things like oats and you know all of those nice things that that is you know that produces you know the fiber that the body needs right and you're still constipated you're drinking all the water in the world but you're still constipated what that is saying to you is that look you are in need of a comprehensive cellular detox because so many different harmful toxins have gotten into your system and is no preventing your body from functioning normally because everybody after every meal uh, you should at least have a bowel movement do you agree yes after every meal uh, the next major action that should take place is that you should have a bowel movement so if you're not having bowel movements then it means that something is wrong inside of your body and oftentimes what we have discovered is that individuals are struggling with all these toxins in the system.